Yeah. <clears throat> All right, Shalom. Shalom. All right, first and foremost, we're going to start out by giving our praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, yeah. by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakakodash. Double honors to the elders and apostles at GMS. Salutations and blessings to the Akim around the world, preaching and teaching is true. All right, we're the GMS Memphis camp. We got a quick lesson just going into how the Lord's judgment goes forth every day. All right, that's uh, roughly paraphrasing that Zephaniah 3 and uh, 5. Okay, but uh, you know, you had this uh, uh, incident with the uh, bridge in Baltimore that just happened a couple days ago, which Brother's been speaking on it and doing lessons. This could be a, a you know, a, 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 a psyop, you know, it could be set up. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's still with judgment, man. That's right. No matter how, you know, uh, uh, you know, they try to play it out and make it look, it's still judgment from the Lord, man. And that's, it's just a telltale sign of uh, uh, this place collapsing, man. All right? This, this, this place is going down, man. It's a sinking ship. Sinking All right? <clears throat> So we got some scriptures lined up. We also got an article. And, uh, you know, Lord willing, this will be an edifying lesson for the elect. So uh, let's bring out Zephaniah first, and then we'll get that article out. This is Zephaniah chapter 3 and verse 5. It says, <clears throat> the, the just Lord, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, is in the midst thereof. He will not do iniquity. Every morning do if he bring his judgment to light. Yep. He faileth not, but the unjust knoweth no shame. Right. Every day, every morning, do he bring his judgment to light, man. Okay, so, hey, that this, what, this accident, or this incident happened in the morning. Mm -hmm. Well, 1 30, 2 30 in the morning, man. Mm -hmm. Judgment. Okay. Uh, uh, you can clearly see on the video. I don't know if you have a video out. Do you have it, or it's just an article? Yeah, I got the article and I got the pictures. Okay, so that's that's probably best. You know how Esau get down anyway. He may want to uh, uh, pull the pull the uh, video down. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, you can see uh, uh, brothers haven't seen the video. You can see the lights going on and off in the uh, on that on that uh, ship. God. You know, like they were losing power, so so to speak. And then it just it just rams right into the pillar of the uh, bridge, man. That thing just, I mean, just snapped like a stick, man. You know, it was instant, you know. So for those people who were on that bridge, just, just imagine if that happened at, at the uh, Memphis Bridge, man. Man. I mean, come on, man. That, that thing just, just go go down like that and you drop in that water, you, it's over with, man. You ain't, you ain't making it out of that, you know. And that's judgment. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, get that article. Uh, you can read it and then, you know, go ahead and show some of those images. I got you, bro. And then uh, we'll we'll get the rest of the precepts and wrap it up. This abc13.com, Baltimore Bridge Collapse. <clears throat> it said, Baltimore Bridge Collapse seeks presumed dead as U.S. Coast Guard suspends active search. We do not believe that we're going to find these individuals still alive, officials said Tuesday night. Baltimore, six people who went missing during a bridge collapse in Baltimore are presumed dead. And I believe it's, it's more than that. I believe it's, it's more, but, but if it's saying six, we'll go with that. But I, I believe it's, it's more people than just six. But the point being, man, that was, that was judgment. Okay, and they, they, they haven't even, uh, well, you, you keep reading, brother. They said, Coast Guard officials said Tuesday night, based on the length of time that we've gone in the search, the extensive search efforts that we put into it, the water temperature, at this point, we do not believe that we're going to find any of these individuals still alive. Mm. Right. We're Rear Admiral Shannon Giriff told reporters. Right, so they're not expecting any survivors out of this, man. Which, I mean, like I said, an event like that, something like that happens, you don't, you, you're not expecting uh, no one to make it through that, you know? Uh, 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 your car falls uh, uh, right into a river, uh, 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 you know, <laughs> a, a bridge collapse, mm -hmm. and you fall, man, come on. Tell me how you gonna uh, uh, you know make it through that. That's gonna be hard, man. Unless the Lord is with you. Yeah. Yeah. 
I still got the video. Mm. But the, the video is kind of just it's quiet mm. straight to the point. Uh, let's just let's just show the pictures, bro. I, I don't even want a chance. Right. You know, brothers and sisters can look it up. You know, if you haven't seen it, yeah. but we just gonna show the images coming from. Yeah, Baltimore. Right. Yeah. Some kingdom gonna come crashing. Man, exactly. See the images, man. Matter of fact, you can you can grab that. Uh, uh, what shit? Do we already got that on there? Yeah. Yep, yep. Yeah. Yep, okay. Yep. What you got? Just a nine. I was holding a little spirit praise for me. Yeah. Bring it up. You showed it to him, what? Come on, brother. Hey, man, that bridge, man. Hey, <laughs> it's judgment from the Lord, man. Mm -hmm. You see, you can't. Hey, the only way you can be able to comprehend it is if you got the Spirit, and what the Spirit simplifies, that the Lord has something to do with. Man. Mm -hmm. He yeah, all things, man. all judgment and right. the earth is is is, is goes forth. For the Lord gives a command, man. Mm -hmm. You know, so those those souls that were on that bridge, man, that, those souls were required, man, God. for the Lord. Mm -hmm. You know, like I say, whether it's a uh, whether it's you know set up or not, yeah. we don't know. But at the end of the day, we know it's judgment, man, that went out. God. You know, <laughs> yeah. you got it, brother. Hey, precept. This is uh, Sirach, uh thirty-nine and twenty-eight. It says there be spirits that are created for vengeance, which in their fury lay on sore strokes, and that's and that's what you see. Hey, the Lord, ultimately, hey, what he do? Put a spirit on that on that, that, that cruise boat because mm -hmm. it said in the article how it was losing power. That's how that light was flickering on and off, man. Mm -hmm. And and the Lord ultimately would hey made made that, that ship collide and, and six people hey receive the judgment of death behind that man. Mm -hmm. And it also says in the time of their destruction. In the time of the destruction, they pour out their force and appease the wrath of him that made them. And you see that? That's what these angels do. Because, hey, ultimately, hey, that's what the Lord do, man. When, some, when something goes out, when he kills somebody, hey, he ultimately sent his angels to go do his it, go do his work, man. That's right, bro. Just, hey, just like a boss would do, man. Mm -hmm. Hey, go, go handle my work, yeah, man. Yeah, go right, do it. Right. Yeah. Handle that lightweight. Handle, <laughs> handle, handle my... Handle that business. <laughs> <laughs> so, pretty much, man, we're we're in the time now where the Lord's judgment is is going out heavy, man. That's lightweight, you know. Okay. That's 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 a lightweight judgment, man. Right there. Yeah. It's yeah, going to be many more things that that continue to take place, okay. you know, as as this place uh, continue to go forward, man. We were just speaking on the uh, the eclipse, man. You know, you got a, you got a uh, eclipse that's 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 about to hit. Uh, solar eclipse that's about to hit in the next week or so, mm -hmm. okay? And they're, they're speaking on how that could stir up things to cause uh, earthquakes, man, okay? Mm -hmm. So, hey, the judgments are going forth, man. Things are about to really start to pick up, man. We're about to see a lot start happening. Yep. And like brothers I've been going into, is right after the Passover, man, yep. okay? These things are taking place. Uh, uh, days after I, I, we just had our Passover, man. Uh, okay. Oh, you you gonna start to see a lot of you uh, uh, Israelites as well. You 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 that know your Israelites. Okay, judgment's gonna start coming upon you, man. Mm -hmm. Okay. So hey, we're in that time now, man. This is this is the time, man, where the Lord's about to really uh, 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 show Himself, man. That's right. You know, you got it. Hey, this uh. This is Jeremiah chapter 15, starting at verse 2. And it shall come to pass if they say unto thee, Whither shall we go forth? Then thou shalt tell them, Thus said the Lord, such as offer death to death, such as offer the sword to the sword, yep. and such as offer the famine to the famine, and such as offer the captivity to the captivity. All right, so that judgment was, was specifically set for them, man. Mm -hmm. Hey, such as the bridge for the bridge, man. <laughs> they, 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 they. That was their, you know, that was their judgment. They, they had to, you know, uh, 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 you know, taste that death on, you know, on the bridge. That's how the Lord set it up. And they had to okay? fulfill their fate. They had to fulfill that fate. Beautiful, bro. So you can't, you can't uh, do anything to, you know, to prolong your life. That, get that in. Um, matter of fact, I'll grab it. And uh, Ecclesiastes, the eighth chapter. 
Because I, I you, you know these people didn't wake up and think, you know, just driving across a bridge, this was how, this was going to be your last day on earth. Yeah, come. Um, well, we're ready for you at. Come, on, bro. It's eight and verse eight. Okay, come. This is Ecclesiastes eight and eight. Yep. <laughs> it says, "There is no man that hath power over the spirit to retain the spirit. Yep. Neither hath he power in the day of death. See, neither have we power in the day of death. You don't control that, man. That's up to the Lord. You know, we don't have any control in the day of death, man. You got it. And it says, and there is no discharge." <clears throat> In that award, neither shall wickedness deliver those that are given to it. Right. And I got a precept written in here, Ezekiel 18. Ooh. Let me grab it real quick. Ooh. Hey, it's no exemption from else. death. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Whatever. If you, if the Lord appointed you to die, like Jeremiah 15 and 2 says, mm -hmm. hey, we're gonna, you're going to fulfill that lot, man. If you're going to, hey, what it said, uh, if you go out by famine, Yep. You go out by the sword. Come. You see, all the things that Second Ages 15 speaks about, a hey, sword, famine, death, pestilence. Yep. And a lot of you individuals going to go out. You know why? Because wickedness has exceedingly polluted the whole earth, man. Yep. Yep. And the Lord is no more going to hold his tongue as touching y'all wickedness out here. Yep. This is uh, Ezekiel 18 and 4. It says, Behold, all souls are mine. Mm -hmm. As the soul of the Father, so... Also, the soul of the son is mine. Mm. The soul that sinneth, it shall die. Mm. You see? So those people, hey, they weren't innocent, man. Mm. You know? They they weren't living a, a life according to, you know, what pleases the Heavenly Father, man. Because mm. that's that's what, you know, that, that was their fate. Mm. You know? Yeah, it, it was. Because, hey, even it was in uh, Ecclesiastes 8 on there, we say uh, just because uh, a sentence... Against the uh, evil work is not executed speedily. That's so right. they were doing that was doing wicked stuff back then. But like the uh, brother Yakano was saying, hey, they didn't realize that they fate was gonna wake up. You know what I'm saying? And and, and, and die on the bridge, man. Right. Come <laughs> on, on your way home or wherever you were headed. <laughs> yeah. The damn bridge just uh, uh, snap into man. man, and that's that. Yeah. You know, so um. What you got, bro? I had a quick one. Okay. And this Sirach 21 and 9, the congregation yeah, yeah, yeah. of the wicked Come. is like a toe wrapped together. And the end of them is a flame of fire to destroy them. Mm. The way of sinners is made plain with stones, but at the end of is the pit of hell. And hell, we all know, is a condition, man. You see, I didn't know y'all was going to be in that, <laughs> that difficult the stress condition, man. Mm -hmm. You were underwater. You don't know yeah. what was in that water. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, the grave as well, too. Mm -hmm. But you don't know what was in that water. Mm -hmm. You see, or how they disappeared. Because normally when folks hit the water, they, you know, they come back up. Shit, you know? if you in a car, you you, you stuck in that yeah, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You can't open the doors and pressure is on there. So you try. Probably hit your head on the dashboard yeah. when, the, when the boat hit. Yeah, yeah, Knocked but, yourself out. Hey, that would have been mercy. <laughs> you know, because that's that's a quick death. But right. however, however the Lord did it, it hey, that, those souls were gone, man. Okay. You know, right. and that that was judgment. Right. So, um, get that, brother. Okay. What you got? This is Malachi <clears throat> chapter one and um, verse four, and it says, "Whereas Edom saith, we are in impoverished." I can start. Let me start at three. Yeah. This is uh, Malachi. Uh, man, shoot. <laughs> yeah, three. It says, and I hated Esau, and his mountains and his heritage, and laid his mountains and his heritage waste mm -hmm. for the dragon of the wilderness. Whereas Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate places. Yeah. Thus saith the Lord of hosts, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, they shall build, but I will throw down. And they shall call them the border of wickedness. Yeah. So, hey, the Lord's going to throw all this shit down anyway, man. Yeah. And we're starting to see that, man. Mm -hmm. The Lord is breaking this place down piece by piece. The way the way that uh, uh, infrastructure is here in America, man, the way it's built, yeah. is, is, is built to crumble, man. It's, yeah. not, it's not built to last, hey, man. Hey, Memphis Streets is a, is a perfect example Ooh. of that. Of what? This is motherfucker crumbling, man. Man, come on, huh? That is the man. Come on, the biggest potholes probably in America come out of these Memphis streets, man. Yeah. You know, so this place is crumbling, man. Mm -hmm. we're, we're, we're these these old ass buildings been up for you know centuries. Yeah. You know they they they're ready to fall like that, man. Because when you look at that bridge, 
I mean, come on, man. That it was a light bump, you know, and then it's just a boom, boom. you know. Yeah. Uh, so you know that thing. Who knows how long it had been up and what type of condition it was in, man. Mm -hmm. Going back to the Memphis Bridge, you remember a few years ago they had a big ass crack in it, yeah, okay. you know. So it, it it could let like I say, an earthquake or something with with enough power and enough force, man, could snap that shit, man. Yeah, yeah. Snap it into. Yep, a fruit prize before that happened for the crack. I think you know, like on off going off to the ramp, that had a uh, fail. That ramp uh fall, man. It was you like, see? Yeah, man. See the Lord bring the judgment, <laughs> That's man. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, so it can happen. We say it can happen uh, at a city near you, man. Yep. But and it is happening because the Lord is bringing judgment every day, man. Yep. It, it don't matter if you, you you didn't die on the bridge, man. The Lord probably you know yeah, had, you you were set for the sword, sword yep. or the famine, come on, man. or, or, or uh, plagues yeah. or whatever. Yeah, burning a Tesla, man. Come on, <laughs> yep. Judgments are going forth, man. So hey, now is the time if you're an Israelite, you're a Negro, Latino, or Native American to get right with the Lord, man. Okay, before the judgment comes. Okay. You got something, Karab? Hey, Psalms 37 to 28. Mm -hmm. Okay. For the Lord loveth judgment. Yep. And forsaketh not his saints. They are preserved forever, but the seed of the wicked shall be cut off. Mm -hmm. And we come into a time where that terrible demon like power, you know, Alishadja, hey, the Lord's about to show forth there, man. You yeah. see, hey, uh, Ecclesiastes 8 and 11, you see, you think that uh, the Lord is not uh, watching, you know. Uh, things you do, just, you uh, think just because sin is against an evil, evil word is not yeah. executed speedily, yeah. we'll therefore, it out. Right. Right. Time he's, uh, <laughs> mention it. Right. 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 You break it down, bro. Come on, brother. All right, this is a uh, this is Ecclesiastes uh, eight and lock you. There you go. Eight and verse eleven. It says. <clears throat> because sentence against an evil work is not executed speedily, uh -huh. therefore the heart of the sons of men is fully set in them to do evil. Right, that's what made the Lord scary, man, because he long suffering. Yep. So a lot of y'all people that's walking upon the face of the earth, mainly our people, you know, you Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, and Indians, yeah. hey, the Lord, you the one who the Lord have known, therefore he would judge you for all your iniquity. That's right. So you walking upon the earth like everything's good, getting the line up, yeah. you know, eating pork, committing adultery. Yeah. Hey, the Lord just adding that up to your tail, man. man. It's going, but, going toward that right. building up iniquity. Right. What you were just saying, uh, the uh, sins have reached unto heaven. Yeah. You know, hey, that now now you're being rebuked because the voice of the Lord is coming through his His men, mm -hmm. through the uh, through his prophets. And now now you're being told about yourself and being told that, hey, you, the judgment is about to go for it, man. Mm -hmm. You can't continue on just sinning uh, willfully. Mm -hmm. But no problem. Nah, we telling you now, man. Right. You know? That's what Christianity been pushing. Right. That it, <laughs> hey, Jesus is going to forgive everything, man. Right. Hey, you got it so like it, bro. You finna say Read something? next verse. It says, verse 12, Though a sinner do evil a hundred times, mm -hmm. and his days, <coughs> his days be prolonged, yet surely I know that it shall be well with them that fear the most high, which fear before him. Mm. Right, that's why I say the Lord loved the judgment. He preserved in his sights. Mm. <coughs> but, but hey, those that do wickedly, hey, pretty much he's going to burn, man. Yeah, but that yeah, nuclear cool. missile, yeah. you see? Hey, you're going to taste that, 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 that play that's going to consume your flesh away, consume your eyes. Mm. Hey, the Lord ain't done, man. That bridge is just a prelude to what's that's really right. about yeah, to come. That's right. Yeah. Heavy judgment is <laughs> about to come, man. Hey, get, get that uh, in a second. Yeah, it's because yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's just the beginning, man. Yep. Hey, what's well, matter of fact, it say uh scripture say the beginning of side rolls, man. Right, but the end is not <clears> it. <throat> Come on, bro. <laughs> so this this man. these things, man, we're seeing now is lightweight, man. God. This ain't nothing. And really, uh uh like I say, it, it's could this could all just be a setup for something else, for a bigger <clears throat> east side trying to make moves and do something else. Yeah. But at the end of the day, regardless, yep. <laughs> Judgment, man. Yeah, man. Judgment. Judgment. Point blank period. We can't get around that, man. Right. And that's that's what's finna go out into the earth, man. Heavy. Yep. So you got it, bro. This is 2nd Ezra chapter 15, starting at verse uh, 17. 
It says a man shall desire to go into a city yep. and shall not be able. Hey, and that, like we were speaking on, brother, mm -hmm. that that ain't nothing for East Side to blow a bridge, man. Come on. Yep. That's that's nothing. Mm -hmm. it, that's 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 uh, simple work for him, simple man. Work. You know, yeah. so especially the conditions mm -hmm. that these bridges are in, man. Yeah. So now look at uh, just using Baltimore for example. Shit, you got certain people they can't they can't get from uh, uh point A to point B, yeah. man. They can't they can't they desire to go into the city. They gotta take a whole nother route yeah. now. Yeah. You know, but hey, that's that's how it's gonna be in the days and times to come, man. That's right. It's gonna be hey hey you gonna you gonna want to get to uh, uh Memphis, man. You are gonna have to shit, have a boat. Yeah, paddle. <laughs> yeah, paddle or something, man. Yeah, yeah bridge gonna be through. <clears throat> but you got it, bro. God. Uh, uh, well, that, that was, well, that I could, point. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, get that. Is it is it sixteen? Uh, damn. Well, yeah, you you, you get that. Get that. Get that. Ezekiel. Yeah, get that. Ezekiel. Hey, uh, this, sixteen, eighteen. This is Ezekiel chapter seven, starting at verse five. The point is six. Thus said the Lord Yahweh about Shimei and evil, and an only evil behold is come. Mm. And in is come, the end is come, and it watcheth for thee. Behold, it is come. I get the NLT on this. Yeah, this is Ezekiel 7, starting at 5 in the NLT. This is what the sovereign Lord says. Mm -hmm. Sovereign Lord says, mm -hmm. disaster after disaster is coming your way. Mm -hmm. The end has come. It has finally arrived. Your final doom is waiting. Come on, bro. Is that not the times we're in now, man? He saw this is this is doomsday. What they say, doomsday preppers. God. You know that doomsday clock is yeah. ticking. It, hey, he running out of time, man. Maybe. Which is why this devil's about to lose his fucking mind, man. Yeah. He about to just go ape shit out here, man. Because yeah. he running out of time. He he's he he don't have much longer to 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 uh execute his so called uh uh NWO, man. Right. Yeah. To try to put it together. He working on, you know, you you, you behind a uh, eight ball, so to speak, man. You know? <laughs> so everything now is, is rushed. That's why, even with this event, that's why Jake is being able to break it down and really look at it and, and scrutinize it. Like, wait a minute, man. This, this shit look a little shaky. Yeah, Second, uh, what is that? Second Corinthians 2 and 11? Mm -hmm. You know? <clears throat> nothing. You ain't, you ain't sneaking nothing past... Uh, uh, the Most High, man. We, we, we through the Spirit of the Lord, man. We, we see it all, man. God. Brothers are catching it just like that, yeah. you know. So, um, yeah, the sick is. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Where we at? Sick is eight and fifty, and then this song, yeah. man. Well, yeah, yeah. Get that one first. Okay, you know, good. We'll, we'll grab them too. All right. Yeah. This is this is second. Yeah, this there's sixteen and uh. Okay. I started at 17. You got it, bro. It says, woe is me. Woe is me. Who would deliver me in those days? Yeah. And we know that woe means destruction. Mm -hmm. And the brother would just read, what, about those days, man? What, the, the end is coming, man. Amos talking about the, those days, man. Mm -hmm. Okay? Hey, it's not going to be a, a, a happy day. It's going to be a day of gloominess. And sure. the Lord is already bringing judgment now on a smaller scale. Yeah. Woo, all right. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Keep playing. Yeah, man, it's going to intensify, man. Yeah. They, they don't believe that the Lord can just, number one, they don't believe the Lord hates. Yeah. But they about to, they about to feel it. They about to feel it, you know. Hey, the Lord about to make it. They ain't hearing it from the mouth of, you know, the Lord speaking through the mouth of the prophets on, you know, word how much we, you know, hate this kingdom. And, hey, the Lord angry with the wicked every day. Mm -hmm. He shows it through his prophets, but now you about to feel his wrath, man. Right. He you about know? to reach out and start to uh, really touch Jake, man, <laughs> with these <laughs> judgments. Yep. You know, make you touch you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He gonna, he gonna, he gonna make him put his hands on you. Man. And that's that's how it tells you that in Psalms uh, nine to sixteen. Basically, that's that's how it's going. You gonna know the Lord, man, through what his judgments, man. Yeah. Yep. That's why Ezra's saying, "Woe is me, woe is me, who would deliver me in those days." Verse 18, it says the beginning of sorrows and great mournings yep. and the beginning of famine and great death mm -hmm. and the beginning of wars and the power shall stand up in fear and the beginning of evils. Hey, and if I may add, it's a lot of man's death going on 
It's war talk that's going on. And, and, uh, they just had a world summit meet. Guess who the only uh, country that didn't want to see stop cease fire, man? They want to keep the war going. You you got it right, Babylon, yeah. aka Blood America. Man. Okay, E Doom. <laughs> He was the one. Mm -hmm. All right. Finish this precept off, though. It says, In the power shall stand in fear in the beginning of evils. See? Man. All right. And you see that, hey, even that Israeli, when they bombed that hospital, yeah. they said they, they uh, called that a war crime. Uh -huh. You know, so guess what, man? You finna be sanctioned for that, man. You know, like pretty much these nations, everybody, hey, like the brother saying, the day of doom yeah. is approaching, man. Yeah. Yeah, and if you ain't eat them. right, right for Edom <laughs> yeah. and for Jake. Yeah, for Jake too. You see, because uh, Jake joined the hands with the wicked. What it say? Uh, uh, Though hands on the hand, the, the wicked should not be on punishment. That's right. right. Uh, Grab that in uh second eight, brother. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's it. Like you say, only evils, man. It, it ain't. It, it's not finna get any better, man. Mm -hmm. It's not finna get any better. This it, every year, if things Someone constantly get uh, uh, worse, man. Yeah. Things get worse every year. Never gets better. Yeah, ain't, mm -hmm. ain't no New Year's resolution. Right. <laughs> ain't mm -hmm. no solution. Right. Hey, but to, but for this motherfucker to be destroyed, man. Mm -hmm. Right. The Lord to keep judging this place. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's the Lord's pleasure, man. Mm -hmm. That's his plan. That's uh Isaiah 46, man. So bring out what you got, brother. The second is is eight and fifty. For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world, mm -hmm. because they have walked. In great pride. And that's what's coming, man. Many great miseries to these people, man. Mm -hmm. And because what? Like you just mentioned, brother, they they are uh, joined hand in hand with Esau, mm -hmm. so they, they have that pride on them just as uh, uh Esau eat them, man. Mm -hmm. Okay? They're 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 the these are the proudest American people are the proudest people uh ever, man. Yeah. The proudest people you ever meet. Mm -hmm. Don't have shit, man. Don't know what's going on. No, uh, uh, nothing about nothing, but they pride as hell, man. Mm -hmm. You know, not not understanding, man. The Lord hates pride, man. That's the beginning of the departing mm -hmm. from your maker. Mm -hmm. Okay. But um, yeah, get that, bro. This is Psalms chapter uh, nine. Like it. Which you got some, bro? Mm -hmm. Okay. This is Psalms of nine and um sixteen. It says the Lord Yahweh by Shimi Shai is known by the judgment which he executed. The wicked is snared in the work of his own hands. Yep. Wicked is snared in the work of his own hands, man. And that's that's how Esau Edom was gonna get trapped up, man. Alright? Hey, he, he gonna bring his own self down by his creation. Yep. Something that he created, but ooh, the Lord put the spirit on him to do that, man. You know, that's, man, that's, that's, hey, that lets you know, man, that's a, that's a power to be feared. Mm -hmm. You know, he's able to, uh, uh, put thoughts in your mind, mind control like Magneto yeah. on X-Men. Uh, yeah. <laughs> he, he, that's why he's so powerful, man. He control your thoughts. That's the Heavenly Father, man. He got Esau thinking that, you know, really believing that, 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 you know, he's going to come out on top. Yeah. Not knowing you setting yourself up for failure, man. So you're going you gonna to fall just as quick as that bridge in uh, Baltimore did, man. Right. That was scripture said, just like lightning. Mm -hmm. Boom. You out of there, man. And then a, 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 then the righteous kingdom will be uh, set up and established in the earth. Uh -huh. But hey, before that, man, bad and evil times are coming, man. More judgment has to go forth in the earth. Mm -hmm. You know, and this is just the beginning stages. This is just the beginning of it. Okay. Grab that in uh second Ezra 14 and we'll we'll wrap it up. Okay. Yeah, this is this is uh this is what you know what the Lord's judgment is, man, is is you know, it's going forth, man. Daily. Yeah, daily. Okay. <clears throat> 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14. Yeah, I'll read down to uh 17. Okay. This is 2nd Ezra 14, starting at verse 14. Yep. It said, let go from the mortal thoughts. Cast away the burdens of man. Put off now the weak nature. Right, because <clears throat> the things we're about to see, the times we're coming into, it's not for weak men, man. You got to let all of that, you know, uh, thoughts of, you know, uh, 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 those mortal thoughts, you got to let that go, man. 
All right, you got to be on a spiritual mindset to understand what the Lord is doing. Mm -hmm. That's the reason the scriptures say, hey, wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of our times, man. Once you know, you know. So you understand what the Lord is doing, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, you understand that this is just judgment has to go forth in the earth, man. Yeah. You might, we, hey, it, it might be some of our family members, man, that, that get caught up in judgment, man. You know, everybody's not going to make it. If you're not... Uh, uh, you know, serving the Lord in truth and sincerity, all right, and pushing his word and really believing in the word, man, you, 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 you're expendable, man. Well, we, what were we saying, brother? You're just a, uh, damn, was it a side character? Brother was like, uh, <laughs> Uh, in the movie, you just a uh, uh, an extra. Yeah, yeah, yeah an extra. You just an extra in the movie, man. A casualty, man. right? Uh, uh, brother, that's that's what top of my card. Yeah, a casualty. Yeah. You're a casualty of war, man. Right. <laughs> you just casual. Yeah, it's a casualty. Dirt. You're just a body. Right. They just count up the bodies, man. You know, on the movies, so like, not to cut y'all, but right, in the movie, you know, they got a piece of man one. Yeah, uh, baby right, that right. rode the bus. Yeah. You know, at the credit scene, right. tell you everybody's part. You know, mm -hmm. but we got the part of the, the disobedient children and the prideful E, you right. know. And then the elect. They, the elect. Had, they, they at had, the top. They at the top. They, they have the a prize role, man. Right. But then you have other Israelites who's just a hey, Israelite. Man. You know. You just there. You just there. Born in vain. <clears throat> yeah. The multitude perish was born in vain, man. Right. A lot of you people born in vain. Keep going, bro. This is second Israel 14 and 15. It says, and set aside the thoughts that are most heavy unto thee, and haste thee to fly from thee. To flee. Slack it, to flee from these times. Right. We got to spiritually flee. Not not speaking of, the, you know, getting out of America, taking a flight to, Egypt. you know, uh, Egypt or Africa. Yeah. Africa you know, they will go back to Africa. Right. You know, nah, man. They, mm -hmm. that ain't gonna, that's not going to save you, man. You got mm -hmm. it, brother. Verse 16, <clears throat> for yet greater evil than those Ooh. which thou hast seen happen shall be done hereafter. Hey, greater evils than these shall be done thereafter. We, this is just the beginning of it, man. Yeah. This is the beginning stages of what the Lord is about to uh, bring to the earth, man. Yeah. Okay? So, hey, if you if you uh, uh, haven't, you know, gotten right with the Lord, you're going to be a part of those evil times, man. You gonna Hey, that's what JT is all about. Yeah. Jacob's trouble. You're going to get caught up in it. You know? So, you got something, brother? I see you over there. Uh, <laughs> uh, me? Yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm following with you now, because I'm okay, about to say right. something beautiful on the 17 verse, okay, which, which I'm reading with him. Right, okay, I'll go back come to on. It. Yep, I'll go back to it. Come yeah, on. Again. Yep, this All is 2nd right. Ezra 14 in uh, Salakia. Salakia, Salakia, Salakia. 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 Yeah, Salakia. Yeah, Salakia. Yeah, Salakia. Yeah, I might want to pick up. Yeah. I got you. Hold you on. 2nd <laughs> Ezra 14 and 17. Right. It says, for look, how much the world shall be weaker through age, mm -hmm. so much more shall evils increase upon them that dwell therein. Right, Ooh. so as Esau's kingdom is falling down, because this is that weak world we're living in, man. Mm -hmm. This world ain't built off righteousness. It's built off weakness, mm -hmm. all right? It's, 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 it's feminine. It's, we got the woman ruling. They got, hey, all these things must happen. Judgment got to execute on a larger scale, man, mm -hmm. because guess what? That's the Lord's pleasure. Yeah, this is plan. You see, and we're sticking to the script. We the only ones that sticking to the script. Mm -hmm. Our role. Mm -hmm. Everybody else, they they just not living extras. up. To, they extras. just extras. Mm -hmm. Casualties. Right. <clears throat> yep. You ain't living up to the law, statutes, and commandments, the regulation. Uh, e, you not uh trying to reconcile with Jacob. Period. You know, yeah, you just it's, uh, it's over with. Yeah, man. He, he not gonna make it. Right. You know, so it don't matter. <laughs> You know, hey, at the end of the day, the Lord's judgment yeah. is going forth in the earth, man. Right. And we want to be on the right side of that judgment. We want to be on the side of the Lord's uh, mercy, man. That's right. Man. You know, uh. matter of fact, brother could uh, grab that and um, we can end with that one. Uh, uh, damn, is that Habakkuk 2 and 3? Habakkuk uh, 3 and 2. Habakkuk 2. Uh, damn, which one is it? I think it's 3 and 2. Yep, and Rav, three. remember mercy. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. This go. Habakkuk 3 and 2. <clears throat> oh, Lord. I'm going to start at 1. This Habakkuk okay. 3 and 1. A prayer of Habakkuk the prophet upon uh, Shinar. Mm. Shinganar. And, O oh, Lord, I have heard thy speech and was afraid. Right. How do you hear the Lord's speech? Through his right. men, through his prophets. Right. All right. And that should put fear upon you, man, to get right. Mm -hmm. You know, through the terror of the Lord, we persuade men. Mm -hmm. 
You got it. Oh Lord, revive thy work in the midst of the years. In the midst of the years, make known and in wrath, remember mercy. In wrath, remember mercy, man. It's so when that judgment go forth, we want to be on the side of mercy, man. We want the Lord to show us mercy. Yeah. But as for the rest of these people, man, hey, that judgment is going to, hey, it's going to drop on them like a handbill, man. Heavy, heavy judgments, man. Yeah. And this is just the beginning, man. Right. So, hey, prepare your minds, you know, gird up. And, 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 you know, hey, continue to fight and endure. Yeah, right. You know, so Lord willing, this was edifying for the elect. Once again, we're going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rekakwadash. Give double honors to the elders and apostles at GMS. Salutations and blessings to the elect. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.